Hi, my name is Artem, and this is Introduction to Bardeen. It is an AI agent that does your repetitive work with just a single prompt. Let's dive in. Bardeen works inside your browser as well as in the cloud. It can help you move information between different sites without doing copy pasting or without even having to switch tabs. Let's see what it has. First thing that we see when we launch Bardeen is our explore section. This is where you can find various pre-made automations. This is also where you can search for new automations or create automations from scratch. We'll talk about that in a bit. But for now, let's run a simple playbook, which what we call automations, a Bardeen playbooks. Let's say I want to copy some information about the top products from the product hunt front page to my air table base that I prepared previously. So let's start by searching product hunt air table. So just providing a few keywords and see what Bardeen can come up with. And we can see here that we have a pre-made playbook that does exactly what we want. Copy top product post to air table. So when we click it, it brings us to this interface where we can test our automation and then save it. And you can see that this automation consists of two steps. The first step is going to extract the data from the product hunt page and the second step is going to add it to our Airtable base. So let's run the first step. So you will see that here at the bottom, Bardeen is going to run a browser instance from where it will load product hunt and will get all the data that we want. And you can see here that this first step is now done and it has extracted information, product title, product name, the link, description, etc. All right, so this looks good. Let's go ahead and add it to our Airtable base. Bardeen has two ways of interacting. There are some applications for which it uses browser to get the information from the application or otherwise interact with it. But for some other applications like Airtable that has an API, we prefer to use API because it's a more reliable, faster and preferred way to move data in and out from that application. So that instead of using the browser, it will use the backend APIs to move the information to your Airtable base. All right. So now, once I have authenticated to Airtable and picked uh, the workspace to which I want Bardeen to have access to, you can see that it's suggesting me to pick a base that it found in that workspace. And this is the base that is uh, called Product Hunt, and I have a table there called Posts. I'm going to pick that. Since I want to use this base uh, going forward, I'm going to save this so that I don't have to fill this in. And here you can see that it suggests what we call field mapping. So basically it shows us how the information that it scraped from the page to which column it will be mapped in our table. And you can change it here. And if you want some fields to be empty, you can do that. But usually it works pretty well by default. So we click next and we run this. And now you can see the table in Airtable. And if we go back here, we will see that it, it already contains some data. And this is exactly the data that it found on the, on the product hunt page. Now you only see five entries here because we're running this automation in test mode. We're happy with the results, which we are. We can save this and we want to run this manually, meaning we want to come to the site and click on it and have it run. So in addition to save it in our personal space, which I will show in a second, we can also pin this automation to the right click menu or pin it to the website. So next time when we come to the website and we want to run this automation, it will be right there. We won't even have to open for an extension. So for now, we'll just save it in my playbooks. After the playbook has been saved, you can find it in MySpace under playbooks. All right. Thank you very much for watching this. Stay tuned for more videos. In the next videos, we will show you more exciting automation. We'll teach you how you can uh, leverage AI to create your own and introduce you to more exciting features that Bardin has. Bye-bye.